coolest teams for a while playing yesterday. It was so much fun watching NIP. So I want more of that. I have high expectations. They're rushing to be bomb side from the T side. And obviously Na'Vi on the CT side. A big welcome here, ladies and gentlemen. Day three of Blast Premiere already. We've got a lot of action. Nork with two big headshots. Oh, he's going to find one more. A triple kill for Nork. All of them headshots. And NIP will just run down this B bomb side. They win that so quickly. Mac 10s, two AKs, and some some random buy-ups on the other side. Don't really mind this from now, V, although I don't want to see a repeat of what was happening. Oh! Hampers for you could swing on that, and Flamey took him down. On Dust 2 yesterday, they did buy way too much now, V, you know, preventing that orb on simple, which which I was uh, really not that pleased with. This time, oh, it's another kill for Flamey. This time, wasn't in the... Oh, no! Did he just guess it? They win the round. That is so ridiculous. They're on it. Just trying to check on HLTV real quick, so I'm gonna have to get back to that in a minute. But uh, it is going to be pushed straight on. Headshot from Simple, quick, clean. Cutting up the third one as well there. Hey, I'll go ahead and get a spray on knock. Triple kill for Simple. Where's Perfecto? Kill on B, that's unfortunate. <laughs> oh! <laughs> All right. Just, just gonna, just gonna remind you. This is who you're playing against. Four kills. I mean, all one taps. Let's see it. It's really, really wild. Like that's something that's worthy of like close study. He's got, he's got a a particular style that's that's actually incredible. So we'll see if it's going to be paying off here, especially around smokes. I'll try and call it out if we get to one of those uh, situations. But he's got like a very, very cool way of playing it. Also, good headshots. He's going to get one. Knock will pick up Flamey. And that was a, what, a 2-on-4 into a 2-on-2 two two in just a couple of seconds. So, huge plays coming out here from NIP. Going to get the bomb plant as well. And Rez is now covering. That's a great line. But all the way from the back, it's Perfecto showing up, leading Rez in a 1 versus 2 with low health as well. Need to go together. Oh, that's so unfortunate. The Perfecto doesn't wait. Split second for that smoke to clear. If they wait one second longer, the smoke clears and they can work together. Look at this, they're in connector, so they actually know a lot about what's coming here out of long. They already have a pretty good idea. The only thing they don't know about is Hampus, but otherwise, they're already flanking in to retake this bomb site. Simple shooting through the wall, and Hampus goes down. That was the critical kill for Boomich. He had to get that, but they were going to be in trouble. Rez gets one. Bobski's going to get Boomich, actually. And somehow, NIP still turned in their favor. There's only 17 seconds left, and they're going to get one more kill in here, but now V could have definitely won this round already. I'd love to see that kill on Boomich because Boomich had them locked in. They had nowhere to stand as long as he was alive. And that's why that fight versus Hamper was so important. But somehow NIP still find a way out. Now, Simple and Perfecto both retaking. That's a strong kill. And Plopsky could have followed him right into the grave. And Simple's holding it. This is so smart. They see it coming. Brilliant retake coming out. That is... If they can catch Nork, then they should know what's coming next down to the B-bomb site. Only 30 seconds, and he's trying to make some noise, keep everyone here. And actually, he will do a good job of that. Look at that. Three people at the A-bomb site all of a sudden. Only two down at B, and that execute is already in progress. Perfecto getting one kill, but he's flashed and reloading, and he's going to go down. And surely Flamey will follow right behind him. So this is all working. That's a huge detraction from Nork, and very, very well played. Mm. And so Navi now playing it patient trying to coordinate together to move on to this bomb site. And I like this from Electronic. Aware of the potential flank, he's gonna go hunt Rez down, finds him, swaps out for the AK, and it's looking like Navi yeah. are gonna say, we gotta save this gun, we gotta save these guns, we're not gonna go for this retake. We'll see if they can get the rotation in yet. Yeah. And they're <laughs> such a hard position to clear. He's gonna get both of them, and the next guy in line, Plopsky's already lower. I don't know how he wins that fight, but he does. And uh, 30 seconds, this is not a round that NIP should be winning at all. Only got the CZ-75 in hand. We've seen how effective that CZ is, though. And if he catches him looking the wrong way, Nock is going to work his way up here. Boomich is ready and waiting for this. He bombs down a B, but I guess it doesn't oh, matter. unfortunate. Probably hoping for a, for a bomb plan and then for Nock to, to sneak in behind. But they just couldn't really find anyone anywhere, so... As they try and move up onto this A site, Twist has got a flash over the top though. Should flash Blumich, yep. And it's just enough for Flopsky to wrap around that corner. The follow-up timing is impeccable from Hampus. That setup. Simple gonna hit a beautiful shot. Not gonna get the man mid-air though. But those flashes, that fl that second flash timed to catch the peak. Yeah. Nasty. Then trying to follow up on on Blumich, who's essentially already a bit lost, so. Yeah, I, you know, great stuff from NIP. That's, that is huge. And 
Navi can at least console themselves with the fact that they're going to be saving the AK and the M4. They're still moving forward. They have forgot about the bomb. That's all the way back in T spawn. That's a kind of a critical thing. Uh, we said time is important. Bombs definitely are too, uh, at least in the game of Counter Strike. Rez has got a kill. Ooh, that's a nice quick flick to take down Rez. That's not so easy. That was all the way at the corner of the screen, so he definitely got messed up by that. 30 some seconds, and um, oh yeah, a little bit of a problem there, I believe, as uh, what, Hampus? I hope, gonna... I hope Threat just reaches over and, you know, baps him on the back of the head real quick once this round is over. All right, guys, get, get focused. Oh, they might win the round anyway. Look at this, 15 seconds left. Nork and Twist, and then Simple hiding at the edge of the smoke. It's going to be a two versus one. 10 seconds left. He gets the one. But yeah, Plopski is in trouble, and Boomich picking up two with the Famas, and Navi pick up a seventh round. A little bit of chaos, and I will sure we will have a pause now. It's 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 yeah it for a second going. there for a second there I was yeah and that's why it can be potentially Navi Navi but um, it keeps there going. is a chance there is that it keeps going the beatings will continue oh, yes. yeah you see that coming in that auto shotgun it's um yeah a fickle beast in some sense sometimes it just doesn't really work even at medium range. North goes down, but I still think this is just fine for an IP. They more or less have the bomb side, even if once again the bomb is quite far away. Boom with Chen Perfecto. Again, they want to have something to fight with in the 15th round. Or maybe they don't, because they did just try and throw it away. Perfecto in a one versus four. Having taken down Hampus, there's still a long, long road ahead here. Mm -hmm. Especially because that bomb has just rotated over to the B site now that they know where he is. Uh, he'll be able to recover an AK, which is cool. But uh, the bomb is not planted in a position where he's going to be able to do anything about it. And Twist ready and waiting. Uh, B, so yeah, they, they should have a lot of people ready to go at the A-bomb site soon. Not electronic though. <laughs> yeah, Nock just hunts him down. There are two players on the site. They're simple. Up close, not going to get the follow-up. He does get a body shot though. But it's still a four-on-two situation as Nip are going to be able to just power onto this bomb site. Boomage, he's been spotted! Not gonna find the kill. And Flamey goes down in a hail of bullets. Eight to seven. Nip managed to pull ahead. I love the drama. I'm not gonna lie. Hampus sneaking in with a USP. With a point blank range. He tries to draw it back. That's a good way to play it. But Electronic crouches right under that shot and will take him down. So one for one trade as they start to go towards the B bomb site. But look at who's on a mission to find out. Rez, he's already pushed up. He knows the rest of them are going to be having three people in the bomb site ready. This move from Rez is so great. He's running the whole way. He's not afraid to make any sound. He just wants to get here and shoot someone in the back. Plopski, guessing someone will be jumping over. That's not going to happen. And he will go down. And the bomb will be planted. And Rez is only just now showing up. And yeah, they've already spotted him. So... I like the idea from Rez, but he may have been just five seconds too late, and now this retake is going to be really difficult. Nigh impossible. Unless they can find one real quick, but there's no HE, there's no nothing to really help take Boomich out of the picture. They're going to have to do it down and dirty. Simple with that P250 has been lethal. And there's Perfecto taking down Twist to start. Perfecto with the second one. Rez, they know exactly where he is. And Navi. You know, the wrong move is get trapped in one side of the map. Plopski going down. That probably is not at all necessary, given, again, the fact that they have the, the bomb out there, so... i to be careful about all of it. Rez covering it with a Deagle. Long range against an AK-47. He's gonna swing for it. They take down Twist, and... Still plenty of time here for Navi to recover this. That's why NIP, I mean, that's... It's a weird situation, but you really want to think about how you play this one. It's coming in. There's the flash. Shot comes in from Hampus. As long as you're tagging him up, these deagles are going to be brutal. Rez with the headshot on simple, lays him low. Perfecto in a 1v2 now. He's recovered the bomb at least, but uh, with 25 seconds left, he's running out of room to maneuver with, and Rez is going to find the shot. And he had one health at the end, just uh, got tagged, I think, from the scout. So, yeah, this B-bomb side, unless somehow Plopski could come up huge, and he's alone for the minute, He's going to have to go wild with this AK-47. I did mention I think he's one of the more interesting players on this team, but this is asking a lot. He's waiting for it. He's already heard the bomb, but he wants to be a little bit sneaky about it. He's going to get that one kill. Electronic, though, will take down Hampus. It was one of the few people who could have helped him out here. Rez is there with the AWP as well, but he's, it's real hard to put into play, and he's going to go down to simple. Plopski, I don't know if it would have been better if he would have went as the bomb was being planted, but it's, it's hard to call. Regardless, it'll be Navi winning the round and saving the AWP. <laughs> uh, 40 seconds 
And moving forward, Rez is going to be the first point of contact. Oh, he's sticking in. The timing is so disgusting, and Perfecto is going to be so angry. But they have to go. There's no point in, in doing anything else. All three are out. The grenade is already airborne. 25 seconds, but this is so transparent to NIP. They know everything that's coming from this point on, and they don't really have to panic at all. 20 seconds. Navi are the ones under pressure right now, and they're trying to see if they can hunt anyone down. Hampers will get the one kill here, and Simple finding the bomb. Oh, on the other side, but he came off it. Yeah, he thought he was going to get run down. That is I mean, you know, for simple, like simple can't even comprehend the concept of losing or missing shots. Just instantly memory holes any losses that he has. Only think about the future. <laughs> well, they are going to be mowed down in the monster tunnel or just outside of it. Plopski with three kills, and simple did eventually get one, but it is way too late to have any kind of an impact. So, still save the AK, I suppose, and just you know try and carry it into the next round. I think the only thing that we can really say right now for Navi is that. And IP don't have a, a you know a ton of money. That's the only thing right now that will bring Navi back is if they can they can. And IP is still uh, probably feeling like yep, yeah, but we've got more chances still. Nice grenade. Oof. You hate to see it if you're playing, but I love feel it. Oh, and then they line up as well. Amp is gonna drop though. Perfecto barely squeaks out of this, and Navi is still battling. They refuse to back down. Bovich gonna land the shot thanks to that AWP. He takes down Twist, and it is going to be the follow up here. Plopski. Locking it down. Yeah, waiting here for a long time definitely must be uh, very d tricky. They, they love an IP to come check. They really want someone to walk forward and, and give them an easy kill because otherwise, the two of them are low on health. And yeah, patience paying off here for Rez. Taking down Electronic. As the train went on top, like it was a timed assassination. So no one it Vector going down next, then Boomich on his own. 30 seconds in a one versus three. Pulling out the Tech Nine to try and help out. Sneaking right under. Oh, <laughs> he's running him down. And he's actually going to be able to get it. He has the bomb. He could go to the A bomb site. Or he could wait in the tunnels, turn around, shoot rest. Yeah, he's going to turn back for it. It's so smart, but he doesn't get it. He misses it. I love that idea. Great stuff from Boomich. And now the hunt is on. He has obviously bought now more time for us to get closer. The bomb plant itself is going to be really awkward here. And he's going to hold it in. No doubt about that. Falls back a little bit, waiting for Rez. And Rez will get the kill instead. A double for him. Not even any doubt in his mind. Man, I thought Boomich had that one. But that was Rez playing that same role. And, I mean, at this time, yeah, he got caught. But he still managed to see someone there. Now, hard to twist to do anything. He will drop the bomb. And he's just going to turn around and try and spray straight through. We did get Warbank by Perfecto at the end. 25 seconds. And Hampers really low on health. He does have... At least a teammate here in Plopski. But yeah, they don't have a lot left to defend with. They wish they had a smoke or a Molotov or anything that could buy time. Oh, he's up in the corner. And he walks right in. It's the bomb down. 10 seconds. And Plopski, that is the map winning move. 10 seconds left here. Perfecto's going to get that kill. But surely, oh, does he have time? He's right inside. Oh, he's going to fake it. And that will lose them the whole thing. Oh, no. 16 to 10. What a dramatic loss at the end. But it will be NIP picking up the first map here in the best of three. Of course, we still got more. I think they're trying to use him to, to see if anyone's going to be making a mistake. And it could be also be risky just rushing down the ramp against the USPs. They're jumping out. <laughs> He's not going to be happy about that. Hampers electronic mid-air for that shot. Popski will eventually get the kill, but the bomb is going down inside of the site. And now it's a two on three. Bomb just barely planted now. I don't know if there's a kit on the ground somewhere, but otherwise they're going to be in trouble. And yeah, close that door. But um, they need a defuse kit or something to make this work, I think. Move up here quick. Boomich has got that high ground as he pointed out as well. So this is looking, well, very good now for Navi. Barring a miracle for Plopski, they should peek him together. He had a chance. Yeah. There was a chance for him to win that had he hit that first shot on Flamey is a good sign for the future, although you've got to be careful on this map. Even four and threes on new could be so awkward. But down here, they have the bomb as well. Flamey going to find a kill, making it a three on three. Campus is the one to make a difference. Not going down as well. Flamey's doing it all on his own. Now, what do they do? Yeah, the bomb is back there, and they're going to be planning on B. What a turnaround here for Navi. Do you realize? It's looking like it. It's looking like Campus may have figured it out. Electronic gonna get spotted, goes down in a hail of bullets. This is still Flamey and Simple alive, Simple on that high ground. Ready and waiting, Flamey looking for the flank. It looks like he may have made some noise there. Yeah, which might be fine. Impactable. 
And that noise is super distracting. Hampus coming back for the fight, and he'll take down Flamey without the kit. It's still, I think, enough time to pick this one up. So that's actually amazing. And again, Hampus is one of the worst performers on the first map. So already starting off here with a nice triple kill and really, really heads up. Yeah, it's so very helpful. They're going to be right out. Molotov into the side, flash bangs through, and that'll work. Perfecto with a big double kill, taking down Plopsky and Rez, and North is already evacuating the heaven position. So now, four versus three, the bomb is down. Um, I feel like, I don't know, some of these rounds they've lost when they've done it, it it's, it's more been like how they've been pushing forward with the MP9 into the hut, and that could do some real damage here. 35 seconds. They're trying to get through. Rez will take down Flamey and keep going. That's a nice double that should seal the round. Good shot by teammate. There, yeah, what was that? Yeah. <laughs> that was Nork, I think. I like the thought with the, uh, the HE there. Yeah, checking, the, checking the spots with the mollies, but now is you're starting to run low on time. You need to get in. After being thorough with your Molotovs, I like that. Rez is going to start moving in on the flank. Shot is in. Rez finds Boomich. The flash is going to force him back, though. Burning valuable time off the clock. All three of them have hits, at least. But you need to start finding kills. And Twist will be able to take down Electronic, but you need somebody on the bomb. And it's just not going to happen. There's no time. Yeah, they did run that really, really late. Flamey oh, actually goes down to Hampus at the end. And anytime I can... You know, get a chance to praise Navi and enjoy them playing it. I'm going to take it. I know, and you got to jump on every opportunity. <laughs> Listen, yes. it quickly swings the other way. Is the problem? Ooh, this is this is Zeus killing there from Rez, and it was on electronic. It's meant meant to be educational to try and remind people not to trust, you know, and authority. Big news. Yeah, do your own research, that kind of thing. Maybe they come in and just have a brilliant T side, like you said. But, uh, so far, it's looking good in this round, at least. Two quick kills here for NIP to start them off. Well, that is uh, got to be frustrating. There's a big 5 on 3 lead, and then it's uh, narrowing in a little bit here. Not looking for a shot right there. Plopsky's low on health. Gonna be a little bit uh, careful. They only have one Molotov left though. Oh, Nock goes down. Perfecto is patiently waiting. They need to get it done now, but let's see. There's the setup. Plopsky gonna get a freebie. And there's Hampus. Oh, not quite able to connect. Plopsky's still gonna be in this, so it's flaming a 1v2. He needs to hit the first shot. He's not gonna manage it. Runs out of bullets. <laughs> this is outrageous. Not gonna find the target he was hoping for there. With the FAMAS, no less. I love this position with the auto shotgun, but he's gonna. Ooh, did he spot? Him? I think he did. Flamey right around the corner. I can't believe the timing here. Flamey surely is dead. There we go. But in the meantime, two of, of, of Hampus' teammates have also Flamey's teammates have, have got killed. So they're still in a good position. Oh. Simple, right through the smoke to take him down. That happens so quickly, and he ends at 16 kills. 11-4 to see him try and put his use outside again. The pistol round, not that important these days. But when you're down 11-4, yeah, it probably is. Rez is out, though. Mm, still waiting to see. And let's see. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Well, electronic, that was clean. Nice and neat. That does not make you feel hopeful at all for uh, for what's to come. I like I like the idea from Hampus walking through, uh, through that smoke and just trying to see if you surprise someone, but with two deaths already, it's not good, looking good. Nock is still alive, Anders. He is... He has been a monster with the with the Glock, right? And these pistols for Nip. Still alive, long range. Except that he's got a P250. No, dude, that's not the way. Oh, man. see, there you go. <laughs> Flamey knew as well. Gonna get one more headshot. What a round out of Flamey. Triple kills so far. Plopsky. 30 seconds here, and smart move from Boomich not to go for the fight. Why give him the out? Why try? Why give him the opening? He's just playing with him. This is just really, really good play. And the burst fire will do nothing at all. And it's simple buying an orc. Isn't that interesting? Really interesting. I guess, yeah, I mean, you have this wide open area here. The orc is still super solid. And, well, he's still going to get a second one. 
This is, I mean, this should by all rights be a Navi round. But can they recover the AUG? It's, that's going to be a little bit more tricky, isn't it? Yeah, that would be the play. Yeah. Just, just don't do it, Flamey. It's not worth it. Boomich. Oh, he will be put out of his misery. That's a really nice crisp shot coming out, but not the second one, though, from Twist. Still some damage. There's the AUG, and now it will be 13 to 4. simple he had the right idea tags twist through the wall is he gonna be able to make it down the ramp they are so close behind him cascade down putting the maximum amount of pressure on the offer and he is not hitting anything boomich will find a kill but it's knock opening it up double dig all the way for knock and now he's got an awp care of simple yeah that was just I mean, one tiny little mistake and i think again the fact that they caught him and slowed him down so that he couldn't quite make it far enough back. Had a huge impact. The comedy of errors. That's how it works. And that's a fifth round for NIP. Still way too soon to really be celebrating, but ultimately it's... um. That's the thing of beauty is what that was. Uh, you know, I just appreciate that from Simple. He goes for the AWP, doesn't have anything else, but uh, he gets uh, the value. Perfecto takes Twist as well. And well, I mean, it's, it is... Not max loss bonus for an IP, but uh, it's looking likely that they're going to get tapped here. Yeah, I don't know how you deal with this. Simple coming alive now with the AWP as if he wasn't playing well enough already even before that. Nork ooh, trying to do the quick scope, and the smoke is there though. Keeping Simple alive, that's awkward. One versus three for Nork. He has been playing a great game, but I, I mean. It's asking too much, isn't it, on a map like you? There are so many angles to check and... For shame, bias host. Clear as day. He's advertising his bias. You've got to appreciate that. Ooh, they're trying to get in court. It's almost like he had the simple body pillow there or something going on. One of those guys had Boomich uh, GIF in the background as a... You know, getting real creative. Get it. What, Plofsky, he, uh, he is, you know, speaking of Boomich. He's taking the man out. Simple still alive here. They line up, unfortunately, for Perfecto. Not able to clinch it, and so it's a two on four. Flamian and Simple. Last alive. Simple on high. Misses the shot. Puts it right over over uh, Nox's shoulder. To to try it. Doing damage. I mean, it's not going to help him out that much. It's a pretty good headshot, but again, the rifle would have been better. They, they don't really have the money next round, so... Move as a killer unit and just snowball onto a site. Twist is the one who's alone, and oh man, that is just painful. Simple though, that's a nice shot. Gets the follow up as well. We're into a two on two. Simple's now got an AK in his hands. Bomb has not been planted yet either, and he knows the twist is up here. <sighs> He's right into him. Uh, it's such a good idea. He had the, I think the AK out, it would have been different. Just get everybody together, group up, and run in there. Hope that you just swamp the defense quick. Hey, it worked for Protoss, right? I can expect it. Go for it. Oh! That's it. Hampers and Nork both down. Simple. Lightning fast and still checking if anyone's pushed up. If you're NIP, how do you, how do you dig yourself out of this one? Stuck on the ramp, more or less. You've got one guy straggling behind. Good little kill there for Flamey. Still trading favorably here. Twist with a double. Rez, though, being caught. And now... He's alone in a one versus three, and it's not looking good at all for the minute here. Oh, buddy. There it is. Well done, Perfecto. Yeah, taking him down at the end, not bad. Navi, I think, recover a little bit of, uh, of themselves here. Well, we're going to find out. NIP starting on the T side. Hampers there with the P250 and everyone else with a Glock. There's a smoke and a flashbang. It's going to have to be quick and they're not going to wait. Setting up that smoke, I think, for the connector as they're still even running out. So that's on the way for a long time. Yeah, there's the smoke going down. Nice shot from Simple with the USP. And how do they get rid of him? Another one following through and he's having such a good time right here. They ducked into that one. I think they're just giving him the headshots. Quad kill for Simple. We were watching OG play this map, and it was super enjoyable. They were so well prepared to play it, so... 
I'm hoping the NIP and Navi both have something uh, of a similar caliber to show us because it was really entertaining. Rez goes down, and that's after Flamey nearly getting killed there in the window, but it's a really, really important kill. And taking on Rez, uh, surely... Oh, he actually got caught jumping and still won the fight. I was going to say, Rez, I think, is such a resource for NIP. Whenever you, whenever you drop him in a round, you've really done a lot. These are tilt-worthy rounds as well. Or tilt-worthy kills. That yeah. one on Rez took forever for Simple to get, and he just squeaks it. Yeah. And then, yeah, as you pointed out, Electronic gets that kill after jumping. So that's not really great for NIP. Those players aren't going to be too pleased with that. But Hampus, so oh, not quite going to make it in time. Unfortunately for him, Flamey was checking. And Perfecto going to spot the push coming in here through B Apartments. Nice little nade there on Knock. And they are just getting smashed, NIP. Try and find a pick if you're holding... I mean, Perfecto could be at risk of getting popped here. Look at Flamey, though. He's boosted yeah. up, and it's so hard to check. You almost have to pre-fire that if you're going to be doing it. They were checking for it, and Plowski will be swift with the return to take down Flamey. But still, that means everyone's going to be rotating in shortly. 35 seconds. Perfecto's just standing his ground and listening. Very patient, and that will reward him with a double kill. Smart play. Much better, again, buying time for the rest of the team to show up. There it is. To execute strategies, they're really good at that. If they could just, you know, like this, prevent Rez from being close. Rez would love to get into Xander where Simple is because then NIP probably have a whole long list of strategies they can run from that position. But when he doesn't get there, and they're going to be running out of uh, ideas at some point. And first jumping down and nearly oh, getting caught. Boom, I'm shocked that he didn't get that kill there. They're going to go for the B bomb side once again. 35 seconds. Perfecto already getting tagged and surely calling him back up as soon as he can. Right up there, the rest of them. Oh, this is going to get fun real fast. Oh, Perfecto still hits the headshot. Outrageous. He takes another one. Electronic, and it's all on knock. Not for long. Simple Joy is in the party. Really a lack of output right now. And it, it has to change right now. I mean, the, they need to get, get everyone back on board. It'd be amazing if someone could pick up a triple or a quad kill here. Just, you know, that sometimes will get the team fired up. But they're getting shut down a little bit. Taking still a lot of damage. Simple will show up with the AWP to drop Blobski before he can pick up any rifles there. And, oh my god, that's so quick. He just jumped to check and then went for it. Twist is going to be wondering. They've got mid control. Flamey's holding over the M4. It's hard to win a fight against uh, many people coming around the corner. But they're going to be walking right through a single flashbang. No one checked the corner. Then it's definitely easy. He's going to win that fight. Hampus will take him down. And not ready. Perfecto jumping around the corner. That is dangerous. Two on one now. Simple with the Deagle. And he's expecting it. He's only taking out the orb. He's just aiming for the Deagle. Oh my god! The leading knock from that room. And now it's against Twist. And Twist has got to be worried here. Simple is in this mode. He's 16 and 1, just running with the deal out. He's going to actually try and maybe swap out for the AK instead. That might have been a reasonable choice. Uh, throws in the flashbang, and he's checking for Twist. He's right there, and he'll win it against Simple. Huge double kill. But still, you've got to be really, really worried about all of this. 50 seconds, Simple setting up, Smoke is there. Oh, he doesn't have fire the gun, otherwise he maybe had the kill. Rez going down, and now Simple going to get executed right afterwards. Electronic with a good double spray. And now it's a 2 on 3 40 seconds left. Nog going to go for it, he misses the chance, and gets punished. And Twist will fall next. Perfecto showing up. Huge stuff there, 9 to 1. Oh no, he's still burning. He's actually having to move forward from that Molotov. Misses the chance, and he's surely dead. He's actually getting out alive. This can't happen. Unreal. And if he takes a pot, yep, gets that shot in Palace. Oh, they cannot make it happen here. This is unreal for NIP. Down two men. It's still four on three. They did manage to get a parting shot on Flamey. But this is just getting out of hand. Plopsky gets picked off by Perfecto on B. Bobich gonna catch knockout in the open, and it's all on Rez. At least he's going up short, but he has been spotted. Electronic going to get the peek on him, and Red's still in this fight. Can't, got to be careful. That's a nice, clean headshot. Cannot give it to him for free. Perfecto hanging out, waiting for his teammates to rotate over, and I do like this from Perfecto. Yep. Uh, time favors you. Sure, Rez is uh, hoping for a series of 1v1 duels. That's what it's uh, the name of the game here for him. But, uh... Oh, oh this dance. You almost don't want to look away. I know. I know, Prius. But it's going to be Electronic finding a kill on Knock, and now it's going to happen. There it is. Boomich takes down Twist, and just like that, Nip, after two timeouts, getting the game plan together, getting their heads straight. 
Navi, go ahead and turn those heads 180. Really suggestive smoke. Yeah, Hamper's gonna have to win this fight. That's gotta be the first uh, first line of it. He's so low on health already. That is not gonna happen. So now, they can't really... They, yeah, they might as well run. I don't know. If he's gonna take the bomb down onto the ramp. I don't see that happening at all. Man. They're getting so red at the moment. It's just one after another, isn't it? And simple, just have it. I thought he hit. He liked him. He did. Okay. Yeah, I was about to say. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. There's no stopping him when he's doing this. That just isn't. It's really, really hard to oversell simple as a, as a Counter Strike player and, and what he is. Boomage, pretty good. Nice little follow up there. And trying to get Flamey going down in the meantime. AK being picked up there on Hampus, so maybe they had one already. Trying to do some damage. Still a minute left. Boomage sees it coming and will take down Ress. And now it's Boomage really adding to it. Nice quad kill on him. But fairly safe. They have middle. They even have connector right here. Klopski just shoulder peeking that. And simple, he's everywhere. He's been at the A bomb side in the middle for a while. Now he's over to be hallways. Bomb is far back and try and win this A bomb site. That's a nice kill from Nork. Super important. Now they have the bomb site. They don't have the bomb though. That's going to take a while before it gets there. Rez. Still a valuable position, even though he did not get that kill. Drop down, they heard it. Still flamey, getting clever with the AUG, and that, it's just simple. Simple, just like, ah, fine, I'll get, I'll get, I'll get after this. Does get caught, though. Finally. And so it's on Perfecto now, 1v3, can he clutch it out and truly break the ninja's back? There's the one. He can't possibly expect all of them to be CT, though. That's just a bit of a tall order. The problem is he does have a smoke. Oh, he's going to set it up that way instead. It would have been okay. fun if he could have tried to put it on the bomb. Still, low chance of actually getting the defuse, but um, could have put a lot of pressure on them. Yeah, he's checking everything. And again, as you said, it's hard for him to guess that they would be in CT spawn that whole time. And Hampus will take him down 13 to 2 in favor of Na'Vi. Getting maybe a little bit of backup, but it's dangerous. They're actually all around him. If Hampus dies, there's not many people left that can actually stop uh, the bomb, at least, from going down. Oh, nice shot from Hampus. Getting simple. We'll go into Flamey next, but um, did the first part of the job just fine. Three on three. And Na'Vi still not close to a bomb plant here. And now Flamey's uh, going boss mode as well. He's got P250 Kevlar, so he's definitely going to be the one to uh, have a little bit of trouble to deal with here. Perfecto has been spotted, but that's all right. And so they're all three players for Nip pretty much set up to come through CT. Bomb is going to get planted. Flamey knows that his teammates got his back. Nice nade right on top of it. So clean. And Plopsky is going to go ahead and charge. Man advantage now for Nip going into the retake. Excellent stuff. And Plopsky, he was sneaking out even as that bomb was being planted. It was very proactive. Smoke up on top of the bomb, making this very hard on uh, Boomich. And he will go down. Plopsky with a nice triple kill. Especially with no presence in mid from your team. And now the flash comes in, there's knock with the shot, Ooh, headshot on Flamey. And they are just getting picked off one after another. Although Simple has got something to say about it, he is not able to connect on the second kill. That would have been truly monstrous. Instead it's Hampus removing him from the board. Electronic is uh, going to get one. Takes down Flopsky with a minute left on the clock here. There's still some time to maneuver for Navi. Funnily enough, they are not done yet. If, no, with this much time, Boomich can get into position, but they're going to go through. They're just backing up. No, not even checking. Twist going down. Now, surely, there's going to be some panic in the communication of NIP. How did he get there, and what's going on, and, you know, where do we position ourselves now? Jumping into the window is not the right move. That's shocking. They must have called that out. Now, in the lead, or in the favor of Na'Vi here. I don't want to be throwing this one away, Boomich. Just wait and get the bomb down. I don't think they know where Rez is any longer. He's got one kill, but that was so long ago that I'm sure that uh, information has decayed completely at this point in time. 20 seconds. Let's see what they do. A little jump pass. Now they know, and now they're going to get the bomb part. No problem. Rez charging forward. The Molotov to try and slow him down. He actually taking a bit of damage. Oh, straight headshot, but the Molotov. Oh, no! It can't get worse, can it? It just... Showing up with the bomb, and they only have 25 seconds. That's really not that much time for Navi to make some sort of a play here. 
Hampus hiding in shadow. He's low on health and it's paper thin the wall around him. So any shot will probably bring him down. Another headshot though. And he actually tags up Boomage as well. He's crawled up, but they're all focused on here. Now the teammates are showing up. 10 seconds. I think they've got this round. Perfecto's going to get a kill, but that bomb plant. Oh, it's going through the last possible second. And Rez again alone. Oh no, I can't believe they made it through. They were running out of time. Boosted as well. Oh man. Style points in the end for Simple. Just boosted up one step ahead. It will be an hour until the next best of three. So there will be time to get to dinner, for example, if you're on Nazi, right? You know, you're going to have a little bit of time to get there. It's time for Simple to deathmatch, we mean. Yeah, exactly. Play FBO. Yeah. yeah. Guys, stop all. Yeah, just get a pug in there real quick. Flaming Electronic, and it is just moving forward. Res with you. Oh my god, how is that possible? He just spun all over the place and got nothing but headshots with the Deagle. Quad kill on him right now. Do it. Res, if for nobody else and just for yourself. Flamey walks into it and it's so close. A little bit of a jump. He spots out Hampus. Man, that was beautiful from Res. A lot of credit to put that together at the end, but he was just a bullet or a headshot short from an ace there. That would have been very cool. Instead, it's going to be Flamey to close it all out at 16 to 4. They managed to take down NIP. Took three maps, but this last one was amazing for Navi.